camera maggot. You're Somebody probably fine. Jumped, do you find a lot of them on the film set. You jump right. in front of the cameras or anything. Lions, lickers and camera maggots. Lions, lickers and camera maggots. Scottish medieval uh, rock, Scottish medieval rock, and um, we were kind of put into the kind of folk, sort of new age music type bracket for a long time, culturally, until we included guitar, and the guitar kind of filled out the sound a little bit and made it a bit more dynamic, uh, and with that, you know, I wouldn't say our styles changed any, anyway, but our, um, the quality of the sound was improved drastically. MPS festivals are run all over Germany and uh, this gentleman came up and asked us if he didn't mind us him contacting his friend who runs Vakken and including us uh, trying to get us a gig basically we said yeah no problem. We didn't really think any more of it and uh, next minute we got a, an email request to the one you guys at Vakken uh, and again it's uh, one of these kind of festivals that you get invited to and uh, we were quite delighted when we got here. Didn't know really what to expect. I mean, we've done a few big rock festivals before, but this is beyond anything that we've ever done on scale works. It's just absolutely enormous. And the people are brilliant, the fans are brilliant. We just went for a wander recently, and uh, over the VIP, watched Sepultura, where you can hear thrashing away in the background there. And uh, every 20 feet we've got stopped for photographs and people congratulating us on our show yesterday. Which was kind of heartwarming really. Because they were a complete new, a complete new audience from what we're used to. People show control is a bit a little bit more than just a band. I try to get across to people that are a clan or uh, an organised clan, a 21st century clan, uh, who all pull together and work towards a common aim, which is constructing this Duncan village. Um, it's a medieval fortified village that will, will be an educational facility basically for children to come along and fully immerse themselves in their own. Uh, culture and heritage in lots of different ways rather than sitting in the classroom. And I mean, you know, books have got their place, but you want to capture a child's imagination, or even adults for that matter, get them out there, get them a, a hands on experience. 